friends! So I'm super excited to tell you today about my nutrient-packed pancakes. And they're gluten-free. How exciting is that? So first, what are in these pancakes? First ingredient is butternut squash, which we've talked about in a previous video on how to make butternut squash cubes. There's also almond flour. That's exciting. Brown rice flour and what's the last one? Flax seeds. So why did I add these ingredients? As you all know who follow me, um, I add these ingredients because they're packed with different types of nutrients and I have a purpose to why I add them in. All right guys, let's get started. The first thing I did was take Pamela's pancake mix and make the pancakes just like the back of the, the bag shows, which included one cup of the mix, one egg, two-thirds cup of water, and one tablespoon of oil. Once I mixed that together, then I went ahead and took half a teaspoon of flaxseed, added it to the mix, mixed it up, and then added about a fourth a cup to half a cup of my butternut squash. As you can see here, once I added it to the mix, you can see that the butternut squash adds an orange tint to the pancake mix, which my kids think it's just pumpkin pancakes. And here's the final product. The kids liked them, and so does the hubby. So, first ingredient, butternut squash, which we've talked about before, and you can see my previous videos on how to make butternut squash cubes and freeze them and then add them into different ingredients. But, butternut squash, why so important? Winter squash is rich in vitamin A and carotenoids, which have been shown to benefit heart health and immunity while promoting skin health. They're also a good source of fiber, which helps keep blood sugar levels stable. The second ingredient is almonds that I want to talk about, but here's a picture of almond meal that's hidden within the pancake mix. Okay, somewhat hidden. The kids will notice it a little, but my kids don't even mind it. And the more you use this ingredient, the less you even notice it anymore. Almonds, um, just in a fourth a cup of almonds, according to the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, you get 6 grams of protein, 3.5 grams of fiber, and 60 milligrams of calcium. So I love to add um, almond where I can. No. All right, the next ingredient is brown rice flour. And if you look at this, it just looks like regular flour. I think that's amazing considering what it offers us. Brown rice is an excellent source of manganese. Just one cup of cooked brown rice provides 88% of your daily need for manganese, a mineral that helps us digest fats. And you get, most, um, you get the most from the proteins and the carbohydrates we eat. Manganese also may help protect against free radicals. Okay, the last ingredient is flax seeds. Um, and flax seeds, I usually get them ground because whole flax seeds, you're, going, you're not going to be able to digest them properly because they'll pass through the body undigested. Uh, but according to the Food and Nutrition magazine, flax seeds offer omega-3 fatty acids and fiber. Flax seeds may reduce the risk of heart disease, cancer, and diabetes. They also provide photoestrogens. What is that, right? Plant compounds similar in structure to human estrogen in the form of lignans. Um, studies suggest that consuming flax lignans may reduce the risk of breast cancer due to their estrogen-like effects. All right, guys, that's the video. Thanks for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe. Again, this journey is a journey that we're on together to health and wellness. So I appreciate you watching me. And I do want to leave you with this, uh, just a little saying that if you decide you commit, you'll get results. So please remember that the steps that you make are going to make a difference. And it may seem hard at first. But once you keep up the routine, it will become a daily practice for you and your lifestyle, your wellness, all of that will become part of who you are every day. So thanks for joining me. I'm Patty Tiffany.